So, what, what the fuck? It's a little child. I'm gonna take, take you down to my house of Pokemon. All right. See yeah, but like she didn't move up or anything. Yeah. School kid Sally wants to battle. Well, I can't fault you for good tastes. Yep. Also, I'm super disappointed that you didn't evolve. Eh, well. I'm gonna assume it's 16 like most other starters. Yeah, most likely. How does it bite, though? It has no mouth. It must scream. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what joke. I think it had a small mouth. Could be. I'm in so much trouble. You're stealing a child's lunch money, Jay. That was just a rental Pokemon from the school <laughs> that I, uh, borrowed. Now what am I gonna do? Go back to the Pokemon Center and hope that thing doesn't rat you out. It's a berry tree, holding a cherry berry. Well, I mean, Pokemon can't rat you out. All they can do is just scream their name over and over. I don't know, they can gesture and make angry faces. True. But yeah, free socialized healthcare is gonna save your ass, little kid. As it will most of us here in Canada. Yep. That someday or another, you will inevitably nail your hand to a board, as all Canadians do. <laughs> Sooner or later, someone will hit you in the face with a hockey puck, and it will hurt, and you'll need to go to the hospital. Or you'll be hit by a comical anvil falling from seemingly nowhere. Yeah, as is wont to happen in Canada. Every July, it's anvil season. No, it's duck season. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Oh man. So you know how there's uh, bug collections where like they put a pin through the bug and put it on the particle board? Right. Turns out there's a beetle with a hide so strong that you cannot, with the force of a human thumb, force a pin through it. Huh. So what you have to do is get a very tiny, highly specialized drill and just drill through its armor wow. in order to mount this bug on your particle board. Oh, it's not electric type. No, it just has electric moves. Interesting. Sub out your semen. Oh, that's the idea. Send out your rock. Oh, that's the idea. Or your bird. No, the bird's on. The bird's been painted. Oh shit! This yeah. bird is not holding up. No, he's drifting behind. I might switch him back out for uh, the burning bush. Okay. The only problem is then we don't have flying coverage, but. Eh. Well, what's flying good against? Just grass, right? Well, grass and bug. Yeah, which we have. Which the fire. Is gra uh, it's also good against fighting. Which, yeah, we don't have anything to fight fighting. Yeah. Fairy. Oh, yeah. And bug isn't weak against fighting, is it? Nope. Quite the opposite, I believe, actually. It's, super, uh, it's not super effective against... Bug isn't super effective against fighting. Fighting's just not good against bug. Okay, in that case, we don't need flying. Yep. Huh, neat. Uh, plus, I think flying might be the only thing we have that's weak to electricity. Uh, yeah, actually. Meaning that without a flyer, we're actually better situated against electrics and no worse situated against anything else. Yeah, I think we're a little, we're slightly worse off against water for me because we have one extra thing weak to it. True. No, fairy bug isn't weak against. Yeah, but if I replace it with a fire. Rapid spin. That one's not bad. I just don't use defense curls on that. Oh, I already got rid of it. Right, what does it do? An attack that frees the user from bot Oh! It's it's the entry hazard attack. Eh. It, it's good in competitive because everyone uses stealth rock or toxic spikes. Yeah. But in casual, like in story in games. Story games, it's not helpful. Yeah. Still a work in progress, okay? Try to find a bug that evolves into a menacing steel type. Huh. I wonder if one exists. Probably. Otherwise, I wouldn't hint at it. Yeah. See what the sign says. Route three, Mount Mutahead. Neat. Hey, a nerd. Are Are the train isn't in this region too strong for you? Maybe you should get good. Get good. Alrighty. I have gazed into the edge of the abyss and then stared back. Okay. Mount Mood is so large, don't get lost inside. Yeah, I think I'm gonna sub out uh, the bird for the fire again. Okay. On the upside, he does have plant moves, so that actually does give us a little bit of help in a cave. Oh, it's a tinfoil hatman! 
Is he I'm gonna not... talk about the Jews? Probably. Someone has to. <laughs> it's necessary. Necessary to talk about the Jews. I'm sorry, Fried Chicken, you're just not doing me good. Actually, while we're here, I think you should take the Poison Bird and Kekroach, because you're not going to use them, and throw them into Wonder Trades. Alright. But first, talk to these guys. Shalom! Shalom. While it's unethical to help adventuring boys like you, so I'll make an exception this time. Ooh! Oh. Never use the whole feet <laughs> when battling your friendly Kekroach and If you do that, something seriously bad will happen. Team Karma attacks Gaddock Museum. Sometimes I question their real motives. It seems like petty crime, but I think there's something much deeper there. So you're the newbie trainer, right? In Pokemon centers like this one, nurses will heal your Pokemon for free. Very convenient, isn't it? But it's a trap! You have a... Hello there, sweetie pie. Have I got just the deal for you? I'll let you have a secret Pokemon. A Trubbate for just $500 Poke Dollars. So you'll buy it, am I right? Actually, we don't have a water type. No, you say no, I'm only doing this as a favor to you. Alright, I just need to get something out of my thing because I usually won't like it. Well, dump three, just so you can wonder trade the useless ones. Oh yeah, that's right. We are those scumbags who wonder trade shitty Pokemon. Except this time we're only we're only hurting NPCs, so I don't care. Yep. And they're not even NPCs with faces, so we don't empathize. Oh, he does have a mouth. It's just two little squiggles. He's got a little tiny cat ball mouth. This thing looks like a chew from Zelda. Oh my god, it does. I think it actually might be the sprite from the uh, Game Boy game. It's just a silver. It's just a gray chew. Yeah. All right, let's buy your fucking Trubate. And he's gonna tell us it's crap, but then later it's gonna turn out to be great. Actually, I wouldn't be shocked if it is bad. Just, uh, just uh, fuck with us. Well, check it out. Water, Water veil prevents, prevents burns. Oh, that's nice. Hey, he actually has tackle. Well, so it's not a full magic carp. Yeah. Let's see what the Pokedex has to say about this awful creature. Yeah, so I think Landchill has a full three evolves. Yeah, looks like. Sem drop looks like it has a evolve. Here Trump we go. might be a triple stage. Maybe. This Pokemon feeds off- Trubbate, the bait Pokemon. This Pokemon feeds off attention. If it receives too much, it will grow to twice its size. Huh. Oh my god, it's a bait joke. Yep. Well, I don't give refunds. You knew what you were getting. I don't like the sound of that. Time to wonder trade. Hello there. Would you like to make a wonder trade? Yeah, sure. Save the game. Yep. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Do, 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 do. It says we've been playing for six and a half hours because of all your speed-ups. Don't complain if I go too fast for the world to understand. We'll Dunk be sent to cool. Oh boy, I can't wait for that level 3 score wrap. It might just be. Wow. Zipping right past. Sent over chi- Oh, what?! The Ice Cube Pokemon. It looks like that thing in the uh, Wario that kicks your ass. <laughs> oh my god, it does. Maybe it's a meme I'm not aware of. Oh. Well, Jay, enough. if only we had some way to abuse time travel. <laughs> oh, I'll just wait till the next cave. Yeah, you know what? Even at 10 times, we'd have to wait for 6 minutes. I ain't waiting. Alright, let's chill. actually, yeah, let's check out what I got here. So it seems to always be a one-to-one -one trade for our, uh, level. That's, that's fair. Yeah, ice body. Slight HP recovery and hail. Fair enough. Powder snow. Blast the foe with a snowy gust. It may cause freezing. It's basically ember, but ice. Yeah. Alright, that's not bad. Could be better, could be worse. 
I'm actually surprised that we haven't gotten any intentionally shitty Pokemon from Wonder Trade yet. Maybe it's just an actual roulette and we're just really lucky. Well, not probably not really lucky, but like we've done decently. Yeah. Kekroach. Yep. So are we keeping the water type instead of send drop, or are we putting send drop back in? Uh, we don't need two fire types. A water type is actually something we don't have right now. So okay. We'll, we'll give him a chance. Okay. And if he doesn't evolve past level 15... Take one step into Mount Moot. See how it is. See if we need Flash. Nope. Oh, neat. Beware, for not the will steal your kosher move. Fight that guy! And maybe open that box and watch it be a trap. Nope. Ooh! Neato. Oh, I never healed. Oh, whoops. How embarrassing. I do like this music, though. He's, this guy did a good job on me. Why are you using the rare candy? I'm just gonna grind off screen. Okay. Eh. Also, if you use it on higher levels, it saves time. That's, wow. That was a good call! <laughs> He's decidedly not magic carp. Yeah. Because, wow, Magikarp doesn't learn Tackle until, like, level 20 or something. What does that say? It was the same sign. About, uh, how the furnace will steal our... Oh, right! Food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you should fight that guy, and then we should call it a day. Okay. I've been here for weeks, and I haven't found a single bug yet. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it, idiot. <laughs> oh yeah! Bug catcher sent out a... Oh, I was hoping it would be rock type. Getting you the hell out of here, though. Uh... Yeah, we'll let uh, Seth drop that. That is over. Okay. Oof. Well, you have Bubble. Yep. Excuse me. Ah! Well, good thing he's super weak. I just realized how fucking disgusting it is that this thing blows bubbles. Yeah, yeah, it's a blob of semen that's just shooting bubbles at you. Ugh. Yeah. Well, I Never think... vocalize that realization like that again. I think that's what this game was going for, for you to look at it and just be like, oh god, oh god, why? I hate everything about this. I can't wait to see what it evolves into. <laughs> yeah, me neither. You suppose it's going to be a level 30 or a high 20 at I don't know. I, well, it's only a two-stager by the looks yeah. of it, so maybe high 20s. Because I know a lot of two-stagers are either high 20s or mid-30s. Yeah, but... If it's a mid-30, though, it's going to be a fucking waste of time. Yeah. Do you want me to look it up? Nah. Okay. Because, like, we're going to find out, and then you're going to fix that mistake in the off time. <laughs> That's true. Honestly, I think Semdrop is one of the best matchups for this I could have had. Yeah, yeah, this is working out surprisingly well, if only because Semdrop mostly uses special attack. But there's no real interaction between their, like, types or anything, so... Yeah, exactly. Wed oh, guard. keep out Semdrop. Wedguard is ground. Yeah, but I'm gonna... How do you say? Trub let, yeah, let Trub 8 get chump levels. Okay. Remember, kids, chump levels is how EXP used to work. Back before you had to do other shit with it. Back before EXP share just made... Oh! Oh, well, oh, well okay. Okay, then. Oh, no. You had a good run. I'm gonna be here all night. <laughs> I'm gonna be stuck in your basement waiting for Trub 8 to eventually land a hit. Oh, shit! Well, That was inevitable. Okay. I was just getting us to the inevitable conclusion. Yep. Ha! Ah, he bubbles again! <laughs> oh no. Get it in his eyes. Yeah. The fool that you are. <laughs> Super effective. I've noticed we haven't actually run into any Pokemon in this game yet. 
Yeah, that's true, we haven't. Oh, well, I suppose that's a mystery that we will solve next time. Yeah, next session. Oh, so close. Maybe, Maybe I should have stayed in the woods. Yeah, probably. Why are there no bugs in this rock stage? I mean, that's a genuinely good question. In real life, the cave would be the kind of place you'd expect to find a bug. Yeah, because it's dark and there's no birds around. Yeah. On the other hand, it's dark and there's no plants around, so... I mean, mushrooms and moss. Yeah, that's true. You'd expect to find some bugs, but nowhere near the population you'd expect to find under a log or something. Yeah. Anyways, we'll see you next time, folks. Bye, everybody.